Hello YouTube and Lego fans and welcome to another Lego haul video. Um, this is going to be a relatively short one. I've just got two boxes and a small package there um, which I've already opened as you can see. That was just off eBay. The top one's from Amazon and the bigger one is from the Lego store online or shop at home. Okay, so let's get these packages opened and share with you what I've got. Okay guys, the first one is this one that I, like I said, I got off eBay. It's only four separate elements. So this is one of the turntable pieces. You can hopefully see it there. You see that does spin, rotate. So I've got four of those. Um, plan is for those to be able to um, be used to uh, review the minifigures. Um, in the various reviews that I do, so I just need to get some other Technic pins, etc., so I can uh, get a proper little turntable set up. Okay, next up is the one from Amazon. Now let's get this open. Okay, so in here. We have. Lego City 4433, so this is the Dirt Bike Transporter. Bought this off Amazon. I paid £19.99, pence, which is actually £2 over the uh, original retail price. This isn't, um, or rather this has been discontinued now, so it's not available anymore from the Lego store. Um, I wanted it, and I was prepared to pay an extra £2. Um, so yeah, that's what I got from Amazon. Okay, next up is the box from the Lego store online. It's open. Invoice. Bubbles. Okay, so oh, look at the fantastic packaging from Lego. All just thrown in there, okay. Um, so I'm just going to tip this out. And then we can work our way through this. Try to. Okay, as you've probably seen, there's quite a few Chima sets here. Come back to those. So, what have we got? Uh, we have set 70109. And this is obviously a Chima set. Uh, 109 is Whirling Vines. Oh yeah, this is Whirling Vines. Uh, got this off the Lego store. It was on 50% off. So each one of these cost me £4.99. And I got one, two, three, four of those. And the reason I got these was for the parts. Um, so, no other reason, just gonna obviously break these out. There's some parts in here which I quite like and will be able to use in, well, either future mock or my Lego City when that eventually gets started. Um, next up, uh, another Chima set. So this is 70114 and this is the Sky Joust. Um, and again, I got this for the parts in this set, um, predominantly, but again, it was on 50% off. This one's more expensive, and um, I paid £7.49 each um, for those two. And next up, I got set 60041, which is the Crook Pursuit. So this is one of the new... Um, Lego City sets from winter 2014. So I'll pick that one up. Okay, and finally, the final set I got was my first Lego movie set, but it's one of the small ones, as you can see. So this is set 70800, the Getaway Glider. So I'll open this one up, 
get it built, get it reviewed, share with you guys what I think, and then I'll decide if I'm going to get the rest of the Lego movie sets. Um, having seen them in the various, obviously, magazines online and actually in the Lego store, I haven't been drawn to them. Um, obviously, once I build one, um, I may change my mind, but let me know what you guys think too. So that is it, guys, for this uh, Lego haul. Um, also, I'll just share one other with you. It's not Lego, so I apologise for the ones that aren't Lego fans. Um, so I've also got this pretty much the same time. This isn't Lego, this is a uh, Zombie Zitty. Um, so it was another YouTuber that got me interested in these. Um, and that is Black Rabbit uh, 3333. I'm sure it's 3333. Apologies, Black Rabbit, if I got that wrong. Um, um, but yeah, search for him, um, does some great videos, um, really do like watching his videos, but like I said, he got me into these zombies, so I've got one complete sealed box, which we can see there, um, and I did have, an, well, we've got one, two, three, four, five, I've already opened, I think, three of these, um, and I've got loads of others already that I've been buying, uh, my son loves them as well, so any doubles that I get, he keeps. Um, just for those that are interested, I will just show you what these are, actually. And again, apologies to the Lego fans that might not be interested in these. Um, but we can see there. So I'm just going to open this one up. So you can actually see what they are. So we get a little figure. And this is one of the rare ones, actually. Gold one. So that was a good one to open. Um, and they're bouncers. So these do actually, well, as you can see there, bounce. Um, but they are cool little figures. I'm going to try and bring it up. I'll get that in focus somewhere. There we go. Uh, pretty cool. And then what you also get information, uh, information card there. And then you get the cards. So these are the collecting cards um, that come with them in this foil pack. Open that up. See what we got. Again, just some more information. Cool. You can see that. Coil bottles, fire truck driver. So this is again one of the gold ones. They come in obviously different ones. So this is one of the four gold ones. Rain blasters. So that's a code to use online. Um, you either get a sticker, which this is, Freddy Fabulous, um, or a scratch and sniff card. You don't get too many of the scratch and sniff sniff cards. Um, and then the standard cards. So this one is Salisbury serves a lot, the butler. We have Mr. Snotty, the retired chef, and Beavis Butts, the security guard. So I enjoy these, I think they're pretty cool. Um, I'm out to collect them all, so yet again, something that's gonna probably end up costing me loads of money that I don't have, but hey, you only live once. Anyway guys, that's it for my um, predominantly Lego haul. I obviously just wanted to share my little zombie zitties with you. I um, hope you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up, leave any comments, feedbacks, questions, etc. If you are interested in the zombie zitties, let me know. And I look forward to seeing you all in the next video. And please go ahead and subscribe if you haven't done so already. Cheers!